Ano ang tawag sa number of elements sa isang set? We are going to discuss that one in this video. Good day learners! Today we are going to talk about cardinality. So ano yung ibig sabihin ng cardinality? Pag sinabi natin cardinality, uh, These are the number of elements in a given set. Okay? So, sa madaling salita, ang kailangan natin gawin is bilangin kung ilang elements ang, na, ang napapanood sa isang set. Halimbawa, we have here example number one, set A. Set A is equal to A, B, C, D, and E. So, we're going to count the number of elements in this set. So, we have one, two, three, four, and five. Now, how are we going to denote cardinality? So, we're going to use two vertical lines. And, nang nasa loob niya is yung name ng set, which is set A. Okay? Then, we have five elements. So, we can read this one as the cardinality of set A is equal to five. Now, other books, ganito yung pagkakasulat sa kanila. This is also correct. Okay, again, we can read this one as the cardinality of set A is equal to 5. Now, how about set B? Ano ang cardinality ng set B? So, we have 3. So, cardinality of set B is equal to 3. And the last one, we have 2. So the cardinality of set C is 2. Since pwede natin mabilang ang sets A, B, and C, these are called finite sets. Ibig sabihin, alam natin kung ilang elements ang nasa loob ng set. Pero, there are also sets na hindi natin kayang bilangin ang elements. And we call those sets as infinite sets. And that's a wrap. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Sir Nino. And you can also post your math problems in the comment section. And we will do our very best to provide solution to your questions. Because remember, every problem has a solution. At kung math ang problema ninyo, ako ang kagapay ninyo. Well, sir, Nino.